Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cow playing uh, Banjo Kazooie. We are in Bubble Boop Swamp, the swamp place. Um, yeah. Will I be finishing this area today? I mean, I guess it's possible, but I don't actually know. Isn't there something else I'm missing over in that direction? I think there's more, because I think like a big chunk of the level is happening there. That stuff. Well, I haven't been here, so I think I'm gonna start with that today. It's possible I might finish it, but I honestly do not know. Uh, I guess we're gonna find out. That's, oh, that's right. Whoa. Frame rate hates them. Uh, alright, here we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. alright, so here you give me power boots. That's pretty fun, so I guess we'll take them. Alright, here we go. Yeah, one day I'm gonna wear them. That's right! You cannot attack while you're wearing these. That is uh, incredible. Oh, well, it's a good thing that I got them with me because these notes are drenched in piranha swamp water. Do piranhas live in swamp? So we press attack to cancel it early. There you go. So I like to press a button because Banjo doesn't do his disappointed sound. By the way, one up and massive egg. But inside that egg is an egg. We will give birth to an egg, which will have an egg inside. Oh, the miracle of life. Uh, has a weak point, very nicely indicated, too. I don't know what's up with all of that. And then at the end, it's a Jundro? So the only possible conclusion I can deduce from this is that the life cycle of a Jinjo is extremely complicated. I gotta climb up this cat tail, cause yeah! Junger token, right? You gotta love those. Someone stored an egg inside this trunk. Ridiculous. I know I'm missing still one hexagon, and that one I have no idea where it is. It's pretty good. Alright, so we all saw that giant gator. Uh, that's the direction we have left to visit, I'm pretty sure. So we're gonna go that way. Oh man, it's a giant guy. He's going to cry. Well, too bad for him, I guess. That's kind of mean. I'm gonna go like this, though. Yeah, eyeballs! Alright, there's boots on top of them. Pretty cool. There's that little... Uh, yeah, yeah, okay, so... That's how you get those. Got it. Well, I gotta feed my buddy here. Is he my buddy? Where even is he? He makes a very clanky sound. And there's a dragonfly. Wonderful. That's right, I'm very good at aiming. There you go, and I kill the guy. Where is he now? Oh, I think he's back at the turtle club, right? Alright, well, let's see if there's anything I can do here before I rush back. I can interact with this canine tail. No, that's a different thing. That's a thing you use for torturing purposes. So, just a whole bunch of stuff, but here... Oh, there's a Jinjo over there that's appearing not unlike a ghost. Yeah! And we got this. That's pretty great. Don't know where I am. Or if I should bake a cake, I don't think I should. Don't know what that means. Hmm, we got like a whole bunch of stuff there, but you do give me the ability... That's right, I punch you, frog! That worked a little bit more than it should have. I don't know. All right, hey, Jinjo. So one left somewhere. I don't have a lot. All right, I don't want to just kind of throw myself into my doom there. So we will come back with boots or more. That is uh, the plan for now. All right? Is there anything like over here that hasn't spawned yet? Because. That's a real thing. You know what? Yeah, I barely have any golden wings. So there you go. You just need to taste my golden wing! Alright, that didn't make any sense. I'm glad that you're sharing. I, I don't know where I am, but what I will do is ignore that big old croco because it doesn't really do anything at all. Yeah, honestly, big croco. Well, there's a little hole there. I can't go in can go inside a croco's nostril one day. Finally, all my dreams may one day come true. Alright, one of these. I can hear it buzz. One of that. Oh, uh, 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 uh. There we go. 
another tiny, tiny opening. Pretty mysterious. And a big ol' zone there. Alright, what's my health now? I'm full. Alright. Full of me. Hey, look out! We're gonna start running! Here we go! In the swamp maze. Is it a maze or is it just a path? I'm not sure, but all I know is that I'm missing notes here and there. Oh my. Oh, uh, so this is a little bit more serious, but then again, there's a little checkpoint area here for when you need to take a break. See, I feel like if I missed up there, I should maybe go back. Ah, obviously I'm not. Alright, alright, here, a little bit of a zigzag, see there's land here once again, and more boots, and a button you can press. What's that button gonna be about? Over there, that's super dangerous, and I believe you don't get like a whole lot of time, yeah, you get 10 seconds. Also, you can't see anything. Are you going to be able to make it? It's actually a lot easier than I remembered. But I think it's because in the past, like, I would try to, like, uh, like, red a tap walk across it. Instead of just going for it and jumping, mostly. I don't know. I have no explanations. But now I'm all stretched out. Here we go. Going on the zigzag path. Here we go somewhere I don't understand. Look, that's not fair, Mr. Dragonfly, but it's okay. So the more one is there. I thought I saw something in the back. Yeah, that's right. You can poke him. And here's a big corner thing. Alright. Do you think we have enough to do a magical transformation? I don't know. You can't go here. You can't go into... Yes, you can. You can go into first person view. This is what the skull says. Pretty wild. We haven't had a transformation since Mumbo's Mound. But yeah, he's back, and this time it costs 10. Wow, I'm like super over full of... No, no I woke him up. And also, he has a skull behind his seat. I can use his own skull for paying him. That seems kind of weird indeed. Uh, I knew that was in one Mumbo hut that one of them had the hexagon. And here it is. All right, let's transform. Let's have a wacky thing happen. That's right. I am the cutest little alligator in the universe. Then he's gonna take my feet. Look at that. Oh, he's so adorable. He jumped. And he snip, snap, snap. That's just pressing one button and he snip, snap, snap like that. Oh, he's so cute. And also, you know, he has a low profile. So you see that little passage here? That's right, he can go at it, and also, piranhas hate him! They don't even try to bite at him. It's pretty good. Look at that, and if you jump me, tap, 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 clap, 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 eat, 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 nothing in that corner. See, I didn't know if there was nothing in that corner, or if it just hadn't loaded in. That's the magical world we live in. How many do I have here? Uh, because there's one I remember. There's the Jinjo. I feel like there's like a chunk of the level I'm forgetting. But I have no idea what it could be. I guess we're gonna find out. Right, so whoosh, that's right. Press that camera button and get lost horribly. That's the plan. Alright, there's other like abandoned notes that I want to get. There, go over here. In the stilt village area of the swamp. That's where we all hang out. Oh, right. It's the other one I'm missing is Croctus. That there's, I still have one to feed. Oh, that's a little bit awkward. Well, I mean, I'm kind of stuck with the situation I created myself. All right, look, I'll figure something out. It's fine. It's okay. I know there's a Jinjo in here, but I have not been hearing him cry. There's six notes somewhere. There's a shiny thing here. Oh, it's a one-up. All right. Why not? It's a one-up. Why not? Hey, little guy. Yeah, that's right. And then you let up, and then I just stand there in celebration. Yeah, I celebrate standing still. Uh, and I want to leave the level in croc mode. 
All right, I'm going to untransform and come back because I want to do the croc this thing. No. If I need to untransform and retransform anyways, regardless, I might as well just do that here then. All right. I mean, I demoed my ability to sneak into small faces, spaces, little tiny crocodile. So we're just gonna make ourselves go right in here. That's right, here's the nostrils ring. Is there like the other set of nostrils? Well, there's that guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Full notes! The smell of music. Yeah, this was not a real crocodile. It was a fake one all this time. Hey, buddy. What's with you? That's your voice, huh? It's Mr. Bile! He's very greedy. Play my game to win a prize. Alright, I will play your game in order to prize win. Alright, game is simple. Eat more red yumblies. Good old yumblies. Alright, so, um... During Spyro 2, I complained how a lot of the tasks were like bad Banjo-Kazooie missions. It's cause, yeah. Banjo-Kazooie has many games sometimes where you go and you do a thing and... I'm already doing a pretty bad job. Oh geez, alright. Well, you know what? I might lose. I feel like there's a certain aspect of this that can end up being, like, not entirely in your control. Because, like, you know, if you're just not lucky, like, where they pop up. But I guess they do pop up pretty quickly. I mean, I feel like that's just part of the strategy, is to try and mitigate that as much as possible. With strategy such as trying to snipe. Or, you know, trying to have an idea for, like, the lines that they create. Because they do create, like, combo string, like, areas. Okay, I'm at 29, it's at 22, though. Make that 30, I'm gonna have so much Wormbles Yumblies. Alright, I won, and he's burping! Mm-hmm, you only win easy game. Alright, now we play the hard game! Silly eat red guys, but yellow guys, nope, we don't touch them. Uh, they handle bombs, you can't eat those. Here we go! So, yeah, so I mean, the only meaningful difference is that now you can't just eat every single thing that you see. And it does mean that, you know, more holes are gonna get occupied. Um, I'm not gonna demo eating one because that sounds like a terrible idea. How did you miss? It's like chomping at that guy. I don't know how that happened. Right, uh, looking around for guys I can eat. I'm a crocodile. I am super cute. Uh, no guys are popping out. That was kind of bad. I don't know what to do. Alright, here we go. That helped out. There's a little guy here. They are alive. They have eyes. Eyes are real. Yeah, how would you ever think that eyes are not? This is ridiculous. There we go. I use my eyes all the time. Uh, I guess it's not impossible that I might lose here, but I still won! Alright, look at that. Victory for those who are cute. Lucky Greeny! But there's the last game! So, same idea, except, uh, I mean, you'll see it soon enough. Go! Uh, the meter at the top is gonna shift around, and then suddenly it's like, oh, god damn it, I missed. It's gonna shift around, it's gonna like, uh oh, yeah, change of menu. We're gonna change how your digestive tract changes entirely through the power of magic. And then it's like, yeah, mm -hmm. and then the red guy here went away. Oh, this is a bad start for me here. There's like no one. No one is out. No one wants to get eaten. No! How did you miss? You fool! I mean, it's not irrecoverable, but, um... Alright, see, the thi oh, do, No, do, do... I have so much like. Oh, shoot, there's no one here. Um, like, there's all those yellows out. Alright, uh, uh, uh. right, can I... Yeah, enough, in a quick enough, like, moment. I don't think so. No! Alright, well, we'll see what happens when you fail. He's like, mighty Mr. Vile wins, and I get chewed. So, that means he gets at me. I lose two health, it looks like. Can we restart at the third game? 
Yes, please. I would like to play again. Okay, but we'd return right at the last game at the very least. Alright, well, let's do that again. Oh, great. Bigger world right where things appear for you. Pretty rude if you ask me. Now we're going to eat all the spaghetti worms we see. I did a useless turn and that cost me a lot of time. I don't think, like, they shift at random times, though. Like, they shift, uh... Like, I think you can time it. Right? Yeah. Absolutely. And so you can use the timing to position yourself to eat the right kind. Yeah, right as they pop up. That seems to be the stat here. Oh, jeez. Uh, like, it's like every verse change. Oh, no, 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 no. Like, every time the music loops. Alright, I should be good, I think. Don't bite me. Well, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Look at that. Look at that. I won three out of four. Most of them. There you go. I don't know how you look. So your contest is just eating? Is it how, how that you have meals? Good for you, Mr. Croc. Alright, I have to return to there so that I can do a thing that I forgot to do. So, we saw last time I untransformed by, like, going outside too far. You can also just go return here and press the button. But you need to not be moving, otherwise you start to chomp, chomp, chomp. Uh, it doesn't cost anything. Like, this transformation is now back and forth, is free forever. But I will have to come back, which is... So I'm gonna have to run back through the, the, wooden, the wooden cage, because there's no, like, shortcut back in, sadly. But... That's okay. It's all right. Yes, it's a Croctus chain. Like, we saw a Croctus appear around here, right? Yeah, right there. I need to be that guy now. What a fool. Also, there's... Bug. Oh no! Violence! I want to destroy him! There we go, and I did. Hey, that's pretty good. Uh, uh, no, no. Mm -mm. So, like, you want to be fed, but also you move your mouth a lot. Like, I don't know what you're trying to accomplish there, so I'm just gonna be like, ah, wasteful! There we go, it was the last one! 100% one completed Bubble Loop Swamp! You see, he does even a little dance. It's a celebratory dance I couldn't do last time because I was on the water. Just double checking, but yeah, all the notes, all the things, and all the other things. 37 minutes this time. A marked difference. Uh, but yeah, but we're not quite done for today. So let me retransform, and then we're gonna exit this level in Croco Zone area, place, look, face. Words are fun, man. Whoa, close view of the wading boots. Truly unique. I'm a cute crocodile now. Here we go. All right, it's on the stump. You got to jump on it, and then you're on it. Look at that. This leads to a door. And this mole is really impressed. Uh, yeah, so we're going here, in this little area. And, uh, because I don't remember when I snuck in. Well, there's boots I could have used, obviously. But the reason why we're doing that is that we're gonna destroy this reptile through hypothermia. But also, I don't know if you remember, but, uh-huh. It really makes me look a winner. Alright, good for you. Uh, I destroyed a snowball that you have to do in non-croco form that leads to this mysterious pipe that you need to be tiny to go in and just... Man, I just can't imagine how... Right! I completely forgot about you! Cheeto the Spellbook! Right! Uh, and somehow, Gruntilda is aware of what's happening. <laughs> Right, right, right. Spiners, bears, and birds are keepers. Uh, that's how it works. Alright, so we got ourselves a magic spell from Cheeto to Book. Uh, when 
spell Cheeto can tell. All right, enter the code blue eggs on sand castle floor. That's right. Remember when I said that place was the most important part in the game? Well, there we go. Yeah, and there's a couple of more of them. That, uh, and yeah, they're all like, like these really kind of weird spots that I wouldn't say are hard to get to, but like there's spots that require extra steps. Um, for 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 what it's worth. Ah, that is so cool though, and like the pageantry that goes with it and everything. I love it. Can you activate? a uh, picture as a croco? I don't see why not, I guess. Yeah, no problem there. There you go. Oh, check it out. There's a snow level. Ooh, this is the first level we are going to enter whenever we find it that we cannot beat entirely. Like, as of now, every level I've been, I like, I 100% as soon, you know, basically, not as soon as I got there, but by the time I was done, this and another level, uh, who both basically require a power-up from their location, are the exception. Uh, but I feel like since I've just learned about the cheat, I think I should do that now before I forget. So, uh, give me a moment. <laughs> mm-hmm. I've just the frock. Oh, well, so you're gonna give her- so, although you are going to transform 2D by- Rem sucking away her beautifulness. I mean, you're still gonna like give her your wardrobe like that's just like going an extra step that I mean I personally appreciate like you know, you're not all that bad grunty no matter what your sister wants me to think All right, do you just start pounding away at the buttons like I, for I forget that detail I guess we're gonna find out so blue eggs uh -huh, okay, but now instead of uh, Banjo, what if we go? Oh, but they don't light up, so you gotta remember, so you... And I'm pretty sure you can, uh... Repeat letters, right? Yeah, so... G... Where are you at? Over there. So, you can just double the same S. Uh, that's not how right. Whoops, I missed it. Something... did I miss? I don't know. Okay, well it's not happy, so I guess I need to restart? Maybe you can't miss anything? I mean, I believe it. No, it's two G's! I know how to spell. Alright, start over. B. L. That's the secret power, is that you know need to know how to spell. E. Another E. Yeah, it's two it's two G's and an S, not two one G and two S's. I'm not sure. Blue X. There you go. Look at that. Now I got double the egg amounts that I can use. Oh my gosh! I wonder what the other spell codes are gonna be. It's a mystery. I wonder if next time's gonna be a mostly, uh... Like, I think I'm gonna wait here. Tomorrow might be one of those smaller mostly map things? I don't know. I don't know yet, but I, I, I forget if there's, like, more that we can do. Or maybe I could just do a power-up, gather-up. I'll figure it out. I feel like tomorrow... Hey, don't do that, Kazooie. I feel like tomorrow might be like a non-standard episode, which, I mean, fair enough. 